So we're entering my office, my beauty room. It is a clean, organized mess, which is possible in my opinion. <laughs> but we're just going to jump right in and I'm going to show you what this room is like. I've already started decluttering it and I'm ready to pack some more stuff up. And the my light on my camera is like really dark for some reason. I don't know why. So I have my ring light on. And this is where I usually film if I sit down. This is from my sister's wedding and then my wedding. And then I just got this background. And then my other ones. Woo, and then my other ones as well that are back there. And then my pink chair. And then coming over to this corner is where I have all my shoes and a messy shoe pile in this corner and some Dollar Tree stuff that I never put away. And then the chair and then this big mirror that used to be in the bedroom but it didn't fit in there when we got the other dresser. Then I just have some Mary Kay stuff. Okay and then right here even though I have a desk I sit over here a lot to do my makeup. So I have my makeup brushes and this thing I freaking love and it's like $7 and I got it at TJ Maxx or Marshalls or someplace like that. And I'm have this tray full of makeup. I need to put some of it away. Um, some boxes I'm used to pack. And then we have this wall which you might have seen in a few videos. Uh, it's still messy and like I said I've already started decluttering so... This is my pile for my cousin, Christina. This is my scarves I need to be um, put in the pile to move, which is now in the other office. And then those are for my Uncle Rod. Then three bags of Goodwill stuff going on. And I already went through my nail polish. All this stuff was full. And now those are empty and there's room in these two things. <sighs> and, um... And this is hard to open because I got this stuff in front of it. But those two bottom ones are my hats. And then this one has my body lotions and my sprays. Which it all almost fits in there. Flat minus this one. And a lot of these, like this one, this one, this one, and this one. They're like almost empty. Here, I'm going to turn the light. Ooh. So they're practically empty. So Because they're my favorite, obviously. But, uh, but this drawer was full and there were some in the bathroom and the bedroom and all over here. And now that's all of them minus my perfumes and my other body sprays and lotions I put in that bag for my younger cousin. And then this is some craft stuff. This was my grandma's jewelry box with some of the jewelry from her. And then on top I have some house stuff, these activity books learning books I bought at the Dollar Tree for my nieces and then these are for some pictures and this was left over from my sister's 21st birthday that my other sister hosted those all are from Burlington that is from my uh bridal shower and everyone signed it this I got on clearance for three dollars at Burlington this is from the Dollar Tree and I sprayed it with spray paint I already had. And those flowers are from my sister. There were leftovers that she had. Um, the main point of this is to, to remember and to show you how I have this room set up. This carpet used to be in the living room but we brought it in here because there's less traffic in here. There's mainly just me in here. Um, and if the dogs come in here they're usually just laying down. This is how I... Have it set up and then have my desk over there. I'll get to this other wall in a second. The other half of the room. So I have this closet. This jacket of Robert's that is too big for him now. Also I don't know what we're going to do with that. And then I had purses stacked up in this little corner. There's just some tissue paper down there right now. Because I have gift bags on this side and tissue paper on this side for some reason. But I had this was full of purses. And they're also in that bag to get rid of. And these are all the purses I'm keeping. I want to change my purse to this coach one I got for Christmas. 
but I feel like it hasn't felt summery enough. I don't know if it's just because of the summer I've had or not. Because this like this is like really spring and summery and happy. And I just haven't felt that summer vibe yet. So I haven't used it yet. But I might switch it anyways. And then I have some baby clothes that I bought a couple months ago. Just three hangers there. This was my little jacket from when I was younger from the school I went to. And then some purses that I didn't want to squish. And this is from my grandma. And this box is full of stuff that was my grandma's. And then some picture stuff that I never hung up in here. So that's that closet. That's a mess. And then I have to close this door to get in my jewelry omri or thing. And I already went through this. But, and then this mess here is a empty video that I've been planning to do for months and I haven't got to it yet. So that's coming eventually. I got a Sephora bag here with some stuff that I bought. I need to get my stuff out and throw this away. And then this is how I have my makeup. This is like what it really looks like on a normal <laughs> basis. Uh, so sorry for the mess, but this is how I had it. So that one, that one, and there's one behind that curtain. Those all are going bye-bye. Um, at the house that we might be getting, there is three bedrooms like this one, but I am not going to be, I'm going, as of right now, I am planning not to use one as my beauty room. And I'm going to try to have my stuff, like, we have a finished basement, so I'll have my filming stuff down there. Not my, like, important equipment, but the other stuff, like this backdrop, anything like that, I'd have stored down there. And there's space to, like, um, have it up or whatever. But also, I'm going to have my vanity in the bedroom, hopefully. And then all this extra crap gone. Like, I just don't need it, and I want to simplify and have less clutter throughout the whole house. I just want less stuff everywhere, and this is where I keep most of my stuff. And I'm going to try not to have one of these rooms, and also, I'll just make it easier for the future because we do plan on having a kid, so then we'll need them to have a bedroom, and then we will have a bedroom, and that leaves one bedroom, and then eventually we might have another kid, and I want it to be a guest bedroom for in case anybody comes over, or um, Peyton and Riley, our nieces, spend the night, then I don't trust them to sleep in a room with all my makeup. <laughs> so I want that to be an actual guest room. So that's why I'm getting rid of so much stuff. Uh, but anyways, back to this part. So this is the desk Robert used when he proposed to me that he finished for me. It needs to be touched up, but I don't know if we're going to do that or not. But the top of it is messy. But this is how I have my makeup. Let's put this back in its place. And ta-da. This is how I had this drawer. All my compacts and stuff. Basically how it was at the other apartment. Which I'll put that video down below. Because that's literally like that drawer and all this is how it was before. I got rid of a lot of makeup. You can see a lot of empty spaces, and then once I get all that put away, there's still empty spaces, and I still only have one drawer worth of makeup over here. And then this is, like, keepsakes, stuff I haven't used yet or tried yet, samples, and then this is just a junk drawer. <laughs> and then underneath, I have empty store stuff. This is my camera thing, and it tells how to work it. And I don't know what I did with the little paper parts, so I kept that. And then some stuff I'm getting rid of. And then right here at my sewing machine, which I have not had, like, time or space to get it out yet. And then it's just some craft stuff. And then these are my curtains that I love so much. And then we're back in the corner we started at. But I got these at Burlington. I just love these curtains and they feel nice and look nice. I love these gray panels. I got two of them for $20. It was a two pack and it was $20 and I think that's a really good deal for the look and the quality. I'm so out of breath. I don't know why. Sorry. <laughs> but, uh, and then those were two for 10 on the white ones. And this window is like huge in case you can't notice. Um, it goes from there to there 
and then there's a little wall and then there's another window so we just blocked that half and we used this half so I just didn't put curtains there and then we just put curtains on this half <laughs> which when you're in I walk I'm usually the only one who walks in here and it's not that noticeable it's not bad in my opinion it's whatever and then I have prom dresses that I have no idea what to do with I'm gonna figure something to do because I'm tired of moving them around and some do clothes baskets so that is the tour of this room I have loved this room I've used this room I have stored so much crap in this room almost fell almost knocked that over so yes this is my working space that usually is a mess usually doesn't have this floor clean um, but I'm excited to get rid of junk and these materialistic things that I don't need sitting around collecting dust and to give it away to Goodwill or a family member or just someone who needs it. So I don't need it. So I'm getting rid of it. Um, I mean, obviously I still will have a lot. I had way, than, way, way, way more than enough. And I will still have a lot, but not an obsessive amount. Slowly decluttering my life. <laughs> Um, so eventually I'll only have stuff I need. So I think that's it. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, I know I will enjoy looking back on it and seeing what my beauty room used to look like in our first house. And I also have the video from when we had our apartment, which if I remember I'll link that down below as well if you want to see. And I have a good feeling about all this change. I mean, I'm not one to like change, but we are moving forward and trying to move forward, even though not everything is cooperating, but that's life. And yeah, so I feel like I'm forgetting to say something, but okay, random thing. I forgot to say behind this door, there's a hook, a bunch of jackets, and then this collage. It's a wedding photo, us, us at the beach, wedding photo, doggies, engagement photo, photo. the day we got buttercup, engagement photo, wedding photo, we graduated from college. I love this photo because for some reason, I was having a really good day and I had no makeup on and it, I still look good in it. And then Robert always looks good. And that was from his graduation party. Um, wedding photos. And then this is from our mini honeymoon. We only went somewhere that's close to where we live for one day and we had to rush back the next day. <sighs> but those chocolates were really good. One of the highlights. <laughs> And then us at the beach again. I miss the beach so bad. Okay, peace.